So, race 34, it's a two mile 500 chase. This is one of our 0 to 110, so some classier horses in here. Shirataki stay for Paul O'Neill is a top weight early bird for Daniel French, Petrovain Madeva for James Shea. These are Clarity for Paul O'Neill, Kilarchi Adventure for James Shea, Serafina Cerise for Hems, Solway de la Mare for Alex Cherry, Class Harry's Pontypool Racing Lions, Mayhem also for Hems, Linford Skittler for Pontypool Racing, Mrs. Dorf for Kevin Meanham, Ballard de la Mare for Alex Cherry, Polypop for Marty Leadham, Some Gal for Derek Hinton, Petricelli Mary for Thomas Rogers, Cornus Val for Derek Hinton, Cleopatra for Paul Rhodes, LB Pius for Thomas Rogers, Castletown Boy and Lady Leda for Ryan Costello, and Need a Miracle for Paul Rhodes makes up 21 hour hunter chase over the extended. Two and a half miles. We're going to wait for him to settle down as the rain starts to pour down here at Hexham. In Northumbria. It's like Ecky Thumpland, isn't it? I don't really know. A few have got well caught on the bend there, as you can see. And we've already been quite well drawn out here. 21 probably going around. Hexham's uh, going to notice as they go around the tight bends here. But we're going to be led by the Alex Cherry de la Mares, Solway and the Ballad. They're about two legs away from laser clarity in class hairy. We get to the second of the 14. We all stream over that. Just one of the rear at the moment is Cornus Val, Del Hinton. But it's Bella de la Mer and Solway de la Mer from Laser Clarity, Class Harry. And the Lions, Mayhem and Petrovina Della. And wider is Linford Skittler. And Paul's Cleopatra need a miracle. One mid, mid course, one wide. And we'll get over that one. Again, Cornus Val just stepped over it. There's a wall of horses here. I might not be calling you all until it gets uh, a little bit easier. It's the end of the day. Only a couple of races to go. I'm sure I've mentioned all of those horses before in some commentary somewhere along the line. So we'll stick with the ones up front. We'll then go over the fourth. They've all streamed over there as well. A couple of slow jumps. Cast down boy towards the rear. was poor over it. But Solway de la Mer leads Ballard de la Mer. The one, two, and then Class Harry and Linford Skipper for Graham Clatterbuck have moved into third and fourth. We've got Lions Mayhem for Craig Allen, out wide Cleopatra as they go over the fifth. Poor jumps by the leaders. And the lead is down to a couple. Long range view here from somebody standing in the field. They go over the water. Everybody's over that as well. So, after six, we're all still on their feet. We're going to go past the grandstand here, going out for another circuit through the bushes. So again, I'm standing in the middle of a field on my own as we approach the seventh. The leaders are over it. This is the rest. So it's Ballard Delamere and Solway Delamere from Cleopatra and for Skipper and Class Harry. And we've got uh, Kilarchi Adventure. Oh, we've lost one. Oh no, Solway Delamere have also lost Laser Clarity, which I didn't see go. Could have been on that long range fence that I missed. But we're down a couple, and a mile and a quarter still to go. It's Ballard de la Mare from Cleopatra, Limpid Skipper and Class Harry. Petrovina Della's moved up, some gal, Kilachi Adventure, Lions Mayhem. And running through the Shizurataki stays there, near Need a Miracle, Serafina Cerise. Petricelli Mary, I think, is up against a fence towards the rear, and then early bird. I might have got that as LB Pius. Oh, a pretty big field here. As we come down to just a mile left of travel, they swing left handed again. You can see Ballard de la Mer and Cleopatra got a length advantage just uh, being close to the rouse. They go over the tenth, they went over it together. Everybody's over it, so it's just the two we've lost. Ballard de la Mer and Cleopatra that are leading us from Linford Skipper, Lines Mayhem, some Gal Class, Harry. Pretty much the same at the front of the pack. Kilarchi Adventure, Shirataki Stay. A lot of them haven't got into this yet, but we've still got seven furlongs to run as they go over the next successfully. Big old winding course. They'll come down to the next and then start the turn. And then we back to the grandstand. It's Ballard de la Mer by a length to Cleopatra. And then some gown class here as they get to the 12th. They're all over it. Yay! And it is Ballard de la Mer. Just they drop downhill five furlongs to go from Cleopatra in second. Moving out of the pack now here. Here's Lions Mayhem to get a bit closer order. Also on towards the fences, Serafina Cerise. Out wide. Uh, 
I think it's Kilarchi Adventure and Petrovina Della, but the one out of the pack that's going to chase down Balladella Mare and take him on at the 13th is Linford Skittler. So it's Balladella Mare and Linford Skittler. These two start to pull away from Shirataki Stay. On the wide outside is Petrovina Della, but they're going to swing left handed here, and it's a tight left hand. But it's Balladella Mare from Linford Skittler. These two have got a couple of lengths from Petrovina Della, Shirataki Stay, and Seravina Cerise. But it's Balladella Mare extending his lead again inside the two and a half. It's Balladella Mare as they line up for the judge. With two furlongs in the straight, and it's Ballard de la Mer. Just one to jump, and it's Ballard de la Mer from Linford Skittler, who's starting to give way to Seraphina Cerise and Lions Man. Slow over it, Ballard de la Mer. Lions Mayhem just draws alongside, so it's Lions Mayhem that moves up and starts pushing forward inside the final furlongs. Lions Mayhem starting to pull away from the rest here. He's a good couple of lengths away from Ballard de la Mer, still running on. Class here, he's having another crack at it. But it's been a comfortable win for Lions Mayhem. Running on really well at the end here is Polly Pop. We're going to probably get up for third. So, the hunter chase goes to Mr. Allen. Well done. Our hems. Lions mayhem. A few of them didn't get into it. Class area for Pontypool game second. Polly Pop got up for third, and Serafina, Serafina Cerise was fourth. Wait for the card to come up. No change at the top of the Hunter leaderboard. It is Craig Allen takes it with Lions Mayhem. Class Harry's Pontypool Racing was second. Polypot for Martin Leland was third. Serafina Cerise for Hems was fourth. And Ballard Delamere, our long-time leader for Alex Cherry, was fifth. Well, two races to go. Let's move on to the next.